now where members of the Denver Public School Board are set to discuss closing or restructuring several public schools. Yeah, that's a Zoom feed there, and it is a question that has stirred a lot of controversies, even rallies, one of which was held just hours before that school board meeting started this afternoon. Fox 31's Vicente Aranis live from DPS headquarters downtown with that story for us here at 5. Vicente. Jeremy, we were able to talk to some of those people that were standing right here just hours before the meeting you just saw live on television there started. They wanted to make sure that the school board members heard their plea to keep the schools open. Many parents were not aware of these closures. A group called Movimiento Poder gathered right outside the walls where the Denver School Board will vote on either closing or restructuring 10 schools. The group said this was their last chance to say they believed the selection process was not fair. Ever since the beginning of this process, DPS has raced to force school closure that no one in our community wants. The people who gathered today said parents and families being impacted were working class families who could not attend the meetings at the times they were being held. They do this while repeatedly lying to the public while providing no legitimate justification for the closures. But in an earlier interview, DPS Superintendent Alex Marrero said the board did as much community engagement as possible before choosing the schools. The Denver Public Schools Institution has not navigated an authentic community process that has engaged directly impacted family members. They are rattling through. DPS has said some of the reasons for the closures include low enrollment, declining birth rates, and high costs. Movimiento Poder said the closure will be especially difficult on families who have transportation challenges. A lot of the parents that we were speaking to, we were we were seeing them literally walk out of their houses and take their students to schools. Transportation is going to be a big issue for parents who are having to, to go through these school closures. I was able to go in that meeting for just a few seconds. I heard Dr. Marrero explaining the selection process. And in that meeting right now, our Fox 31 reporter, Kasha Carriage, is in there. We will, of course, have updates on how that meeting goes. The school board expected to vote on those closures and restructuring tonight. Reporting live downtown Denver, Vicente Arenas, Fox 31.